Well, this is the best way to reseal these cans a chassis saver or a pour 15. I use chassis saver because if you buy a gallon of chassis saver, it's cheaper than pour 15. It's the same crap, different brand basically. But the best way to reseal these cans, you know what I've been doing? And I know this works because this can is well over a year old and it didn't dry out. I just take a screwdriver, Phillips, punch a hole in the can, right? You know, with a hammer. And I put like a double piece of tape. You can see that's a double piece of tape over here over the hole after I use it. And the type of tape I use is this uh, Gorilla Tape. And that's it. And there's a little bit of chassis saver up around the hole so it kind of glues it in here. This was a screw I did. but And you can just re-punch. I was starting to punch different holes in there because I only use this crap a little bit at a time. This I think this is two years old now. And it's it's none of it's dried out. I know they tell you like to reseal the lid with um, put a plastic cellophane paper in there, um, you know that's plastic wrap garbage, and that'll keep it from sticking. And or maybe you can use grease or something. Maybe this works way better, and it's easier to pour out these big cans of these big cans because you have this little hole. I, I just pour a little bit out on wherever wherever um you know, I'm going to apply it to and spread it around with a brush or even a paper towel or something, and then I'm done. And I just, um, a lot of times you can pull these off, but if you can't pull them off, just punch a hole right through where you punch the last hole, right through this Gorilla Tape, and then just um, put a little bit of chassis, well, when you pour it out, it's going to get a little on here, so when you put the tape on it, it's going to... The chassis saver is going to work like a glue, and I put two pieces of tape. But since this, I think this is about two years old now, this can, it didn't dry out. So I know it works. So man, that's a big money saver. Because I think if you buy, what's a quart of this stuff? 50 bucks, 45 bucks? This was like 105 bucks for a gallon. Man, this stuff is lasting a long, long, long time. The problem is when you buy a gallon, Oh, yeah, it's cheap, but, you know, if it dries out on you, it's screwed up. This has not dried out, and it's been a lot easier to reuse. It's actually easier to reuse than anything, man. So this is a Rebel <laughs> a rebel Confederate tip uh, for you people out there. Because uh, we're fighting the freaking powers here with this garbage. Um, and I wasn't sure if this was going to work when I first did it. But you can see how old this can is. It's got rust on it. It's been opened up. It's been, you know, it's not it, that's surface rust from just being laying around. It's and I just reused it tonight. I just did a few more pieces of metal for the uh, El Camino floor to for the last three pieces. Wanted a chassis saver room, chassis saver, get the crap on here, dry it, and before I put the uh, epoxy and rivets because I don't want to weld. I want to have a bunch of chassis saver in here because wherever you weld, it's going to be bare metal behind behind where you can't reach with the chassis saver right so that's why I'm, that's my logic but man this method works fine and it's easy it's easy it's neater you don't waste as much now why is nobody recommending this because nobody tried this but don't use masking tape to seal it up don't use i'm using this gorilla tape just a couple small pieces you can see it right here one two pieces there's actually two pieces here there's two pieces here and it's got a little bit of chassis saver down here which actually glues the tape to this and two slices two pieces of, of tape over that little hole keeps it um 100% airtight and then, like I said if you just gotta gotta use it again here's a hole right just punch right through the freaking tape and you're good to go so man it's just, it's I mean, if you're buying like a whole bunch of these little cans man you're gonna be going through money like crazy I mean if you bought a bunch of little cans like this it would probably be about, I don't know, five, six times as much money. Literally. This is a big money saver. And I, and I think this can is going to last me freaking five more years easy.